Hi, my name is Anders. I'm going to show you how to create your first watermark. First of all, we have to select either a file or directory we want to add watermarks to. We can choose a single file, multiple files, or an entire directory. I'll go with all these files. I'm holding shift down and I can select multiple files and they are shown at this page. I can choose another image from my preview image if I want to do that. Then I'll go to the second tab where there is a default watermark and this is a text watermark so I can write my text I want to use here. Hi, this is a watermark. To change the type of watermark you can either double click this and select for example a text watermark or as it was before you can change it to a 3D text watermark. If you want to add more watermarks, you can add a layer. I'll create a border effect for the watermark to frame it. And I want it a little bit from the edge and I want a bigger border, not that big. So let's say 1.3% of the image. Let's see how that looks. That looks pretty okay, and we have to move this one to the middle of the image, we move it here. So now I've set up my watermarks. And I need to save it somewhere, so I go to the third tab. And again, I can have multiple outputs, so I can save it as a big image, as a small image, uh, and in multiple folders. I select where I want to save my watermark photos, here. I could rename them if I wanted to. And I choose to save them as the same format as the original images. And I want to preserve all the metadata in the files. And I do not want to resize the files. So that's about it. And we press the save watermarks. And wait a few seconds for each watermark. And the program will then finalize the watermarking and open the folder containing all the watermarked images. And we can see that the watermark is in all the pictures. Thank you for watching.